Information about an overnight officer involved shooting in Castle Rock. Yeah, a viewer giving us exclusive video of the entire encounter. Fox 31's Nicole Fierro live for us here at 5 with the latest. Nicole. Yeah, Castle Rock's known for its calm, quiet community. That's why this was so shocking for people living at this apartment complex, seeing and hearing everything right around 10 o'clock last night. Oh, 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 oh. This is not the end of the night in Castle Rock. Holden Warfield was anticipating. You see all the stories up in Denver or Aurora, but never really in Castle Rock. So, you know, it's kind of, you know, you just get get that curious urge to see what happened. Leaving his dad's apartment complex, he ended up getting a driver's seat view of an officer involved shooting at the Ridge at Castle Rock apartment clubhouse. And there's a cop blocking it off and he already told one car to turn around, told us to go somewhere else because they, they already had their guns out facing at the clubhouse. And then I could hear someone inside yelling and smashing stuff around, just screaming. They're yelling at him to put his hands up. And that's when Warfield started recording. They were yelling at him for a bit, then it was pretty much silent. And then all of a sudden you hear one shot and then you just hear a bunch of shots. This scene video from this morning showing broken glass and crime tape around the clubhouse. Castle Rock police sharing limited information so far. They were called to the area around 1030. No officers were hurt and an adult suspect was pronounced dead. And those apartments are relatively new. You don't really see anything happening there. And especially with that with the uh, amount of police that started showing up. While Warfield was shocked, he feels the Castle Rock police response is comforting. The way the cops handled it, they were, it was very, very quick. Even if you live in the apartments, it was completely safe. The crossfire, everything. I, I have nothing but respect for them. And the police department told us they'd be giving us an update anytime today. So as soon as we get that, we'll be sure to bring it to you on air and online. Reporting live here in Castle Rock, Nicole Fierro, Fox 30. Nicole,